Okay, welcome back. It's No Man's Sky. You're here with Gaming Mike. Tonight we're going to take it easy. We're going to do some planetary exploration. I want to look for some big animals still. I'm still crawling around the haze zone near the center of the Euclid galaxy. Uh, as far as the four-person meetup that's been planned, I'm here, Rob is here, Ryan made it this week, and Pyotr Pew Pew is coming up quickly. Hopefully we're going to be able to do that this weekend, actually. We were all going to jump into the center of the now-claimed Euclid galaxy. I can't believe that guy got his name on it. Today, well, no, I guess it was claimed to me. Well, let's, let's take a look. For those that didn't see, uh, Isabella, welcome to the chat. Welcome back. Nice to see you. Masked Hero is here. Sav Jazz and Bone Junkie. Nice. Anybody else who hasn't said, hey, feel free to say, hey, if you're watching, if you're lurking, we want to talk to you about the game. So, let's see. <laughs> Path towards center. If I go here, look at sticks. Stick ZZ. Stick ZZ. Sticks. Claimed it on the 5th. On the 5th of this month, two days ago, at 1.13 in the friggin' afternoon, this guy playing found it. He did it. He did something. Nobody knows. He's not a big time YouTuber, that's for sure. He's, uh, he's just, I like to think he's some 12 year old kid that doesn't know what he did, that has no idea about the hubbub surrounding this game, and no idea about the, the ramifications of such an act, such a blatant, in your face act of uh, puzzle mastery. <laughs> puzzle mastery. <laughs> I don't know. I'm impressed. If somebody solved this game, that's awesome. I think that's awesome. Uh, I would have loved to have been the guy. I would have loved it. The sixth. Yeah, it is the sixth in some time zones. I saw. I was watching Serious Gamer X's stream today, and on his it says it was claimed on the sixth at 1:13 in the morning, so 12 hours ahead of where I am. I'm sorry, that's not 1. I'm reading 16 as though it is 13, and that's not the case. That's 4.13. So they're 8 hours ahead. <laughs> I can math. Anyway, so, Prowler, welcome to the chat as well. That's kind of where things are. I went crawling around here earlier today. You can see my last stream. I tried looking for signs of this guy's other discoveries, like trying to find where he jumped from to get to the center. And I'm still going to keep an eye out for, the, for that as I crawl through the stars, but I'm actually going to make my way back towards the meeting place system, which I'm going to have to take it and find it. I did not, I did not really realize how uh, palindromic 6-10-2016 was. Yeah, that is a much better date. <laughs> Yeah, it doesn't, it doesn't quite surprise me that the center didn't get renamed. Especially with the, the picture I was just telling you about, I have in my head of the guy who did this, of who Styx is. I like to think it's, like I said, a 12-year-old kid that doesn't know what he did. And I also imagine that he just, he stopped renaming stuff in this game, like, probably a month ago. And he's just been giving it whatever random names, and, and he just blasted right through the center without even thinking about it. That's what I like to imagine. That's the legend of sticks as I have made it up so far in my head. But, uh... I don't know, man. Somebody's got to get a hold of that guy and find out what the hell is going on. Somebody has to. He's going to sell the rights. He's going to sell the rights to his story to some gaming internet magazine. Yeah, Prowler 901. That's the big mystery of it. Nobody knows how he got his name on that thing. It just showed up. It just showed up. As of yet, as far as I know, nobody knows how he did it. So, that's why I've made up a story of my own. Because that's what people do. That's human nature. Something weird happens and you don't know why. 
So you make up a story about why it happened. It's just what you do. Why is this a waypoint? I didn't set that. Babylon bad boy. Sean Murray is a dirty liar. Why did that get marked as a waypoint for me? Did I set that? I didn't set that. I saw the system earlier when I was crawling around and it made me laugh. Yeah, and if yeah, that's a good point, Sav Jazz. If if the legend I've made up is even close to the truth, and we've all been thinking about this game way too hard. <laughs> but that's also why I like the story that I'm making up, because it makes it all a big joke. And at this point, yeah, why not? Why not be a big joke? Sav Jazz, which color star systems is it that have the best animals? I remember you were saying it a while ago. I think you figured it out with your notes. Like, you started to see that a certain color star system had better large animals. If you can tell me what that is, I want to keep an eye out for those systems. Illuminati psychological horror. <laughs> That's funny. Are you be seen offline? Aaron Macklin, what... Welcome to the chat, and what does your question mean? <laughs> I don't know if I are be seen offline. I don't know. Rudlas for Rordne, undiscovered three planets. I should have. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do the thing to find the meeting place system again. I need to head back there. I need to head back of that away. I've been distracted. Rob found a portal on Canberra in the meeting place system today too. Oh, that's right. I was gonna go to Canberra. And uh, I need to get some time lapses by that portal before we leave by Cracky. I need to get some time lapses. Oh, do I appear offline? I don't know. In what? In YouTube? I shouldn't appear offline. Not if you're chatting in the stream. On PlayStation? I don't know. Do I? Okay, there's the three stars. I saw them. There they are. That means I go this way. And a little this way and a little more... I shouldn't have turned like that. That's not, that's, nope. Yeah, right there, right there, right there. These, boom, it's so easy now. It's so easy to find now. <laughs> I should redo my how to find this place video because it's way easier than I make it in that seven minute clip. Too far to jump. I need to set a waypoint. Uh, Aaron Macklin, no plans for Diablo as of yet. Uh, we'll see how NMS goes. I also have the last episode of Luke Cage to watch. I was going to probably do that tonight at some point. So I don't know. We'll see. For now, oh, we're set the waypoint. You have to wait. These waypoints take a minute to set now. The load times on this game got longer at some point. It happened. It happened. Don't tell me it didn't happen. I saw it happen. Show me my waypoint, please. Show me the waypoint to go home. Oh, there it is. Look. Out there in the stars. Out there in the stars. Oh, now it'll show me the waypoint. Look at this. What kind of path is that? What kind of path is that? Here, go... <laughs> that way and then that way but then 
instead of going from here to here, it wants you to go from here to here to here. Hey, two planets, one moon. Matt Valentine. Durr plant 09. Durr plant. And then way up here and up here and up and over and up over to here. This is the way it's sending me. That's bogus. That's bunkum. Meeting place is that way. Can I fly to here? Pick a random star. <laughs> I didn't hear. If, I didn't see if Sav Jazz answered. Green is. Oh, there it is. Green is best for fauna. Avoid blue. Green is best for fauna. Okay. I'm gonna focus on green stars then. I'm gonna focus on the green stalls. Oh, don't take me way back here. I didn't mean to do that. Meeting place is up that way, like right that way. Nope, I'm not gonna be able to cut through the haze though. I know that. I know this. I know this. So I need to go up. You pick it up. You pick it up. You pick it up. <laughs> See, Masked Hero? Isabella likes your profile picture. Good thing you changed it. Right? Good thing you picked the profile picture, Masked Hero. We peer pressured Masked Hero into adopting an actual profile picture the other night. It's, uh, you know, it's what we do as a gang. We peer pressure people. There's a green star. Four planets, one moon. Undiscovered. But I can go further. No, you know what? I like the looks of Zigang Tuang T. Hashtag did it for Mike. That's right. On our way. Here we go. Hey, thanks for stopping by the stream tonight, though. You're here with Gaming Mike. It's No Man's Sky. Be sure to click that like button if you're enjoying the stream, and be sure to subscribe if you would like to see more in the future. I like to stream the video games. It's pretty fun. Feel free to join in the chat. We got the Gecknip gang in strong support tonight. They're all friendly. Don't be afraid to say hi. You might just have an even better time if you do. That's not a threat, and it's not a promise. Oh, show me the name, please. Show me the name. Zigang Tong 11 in the Evliakwell region. Yeah, it's an E4PF with four planets. And one moon. You'll find it about 825.5 light years from the center of the Euclid galaxy. Feel free to stop by. Let's find out if it's got any good animal life. I want to see a big beastie. That's what we're focusing our thoughts on tonight. Big beasties. We want to see big, large, weird animals. So think about that. Steve B41, welcome back. Good to see ya. Where's that moon? Show me that moon. I want to go to that moon. That moon. That moon. 
got to get a better view. I got to get a better view. Out of my way. You're blocking my view. What do I do when you're blocking my view? I will shoot you. What's this one? Just a planet. Where where are these? There. Where's your moon? Where's your moon? Show me your moon. Oh it doesn't want to. That's okay. Moon's a little shy. We'll find it. We'll find it. Oh, Eric Hoffman. No, no. No, no, Eric Hoffman. John Otter, welcome to the stream. Green star system. Yeah, that's where we've just landed, Steve. That's what Savjaz said, too. Green star system for bigger creatures. I'm going to check this moon first and then on to the planets. I have a feeling that it's probably planets that have the bigger creatures as opposed to moons, but uh, I just, you know, I've made such a habit out of checking the moons first that that's just what I do now. Aaron is your fan troll? Has this guy been bothering you? Just following you around trolling you? Is that what you're telling me? Or is it some in-joke? I don't want to ruin your in-joke. But if he's just being one of those trolls, I know what to do. Oh, he's the guy with all the accounts. Huh. Interesting. What is it about... Nah, who cares? <laughs> I was going to think about it for a second, but... I'm almost to this moon, so why bother? I, uh, I'd like to thank the trolls for viewing my videos. That helps my stats. I appreciate you. Especially when you guys interact with the buttons on the page. That's always good for a YouTuber. So, um, keep it up. time on my hands. That's right. That's right. <laughs> Law 712, welcome back to the chat and the stream. Thanks for joining us tonight. Iket Lacadio. Iket Lacadio. Oh, if you guys want to go ahead and guess on the weather or the sentinels or the flora or the fauna of this planet, feel free to enter those guesses now before I land. And uh, if you get any one of those words the same as it is in the game, why, I'll name this moon after you. Cindy Lou Who. Weather, sentinels... Flora, Fauna. And with that, I'm going to land as soon as I find something worth looking at. Like a monolith where I can learn an atlas word, or uh, a portal would be nice. I'd take a portal right about now, that'd be sweet. Perpetually balmy. Oh, 
Oh, I'm gonna land. I am. I swear. Just as soon as something shows its face, something worthwhile. Fine. Ah, oh, I choose this mountain. I choose this. What do we have? What do we have? Damp, average, copious, sporadic. <laughs> Damp. <laughs> average, copious, and sporadic. Oh, and what was the place called? What's it called? Iket Lacadio. Iket Lacadio. Okay, time to check the guesses. Damp, average, copious, sporadic. Did anybody get it? Yeah, we got Balmy. Oh, Sav Jazz said average. Sav Jazz said average. He didn't specify what, but he did say average. Yep. Nice. That'll do. That'll do. This one is Sav Jazz. Any special name you'd like, or shall I just call it? Uh, oh no, what's what's your Sav Jazz? What have you been naming your systems? I'm gonna put this in your Federation of Planets or whatever. But what do you call it? Remind me in the chat. I want to add this to your planets, to your collection. The Jazzman Federation of Worlds. I think it was something like that. Jazzman Federation Federated. Jazzman Worlds Federation. Yeah, yeah. Federation. Jazzman Worlds Federation. Yep. Boom. There you go. Good guessing. That planet's now part of your conglomeration, your collection. Oh, nice planet. I mean, nice moon. It's a Lushy. One moment, sorry guys. All right, I'm back. Arctic J, welcome to the chat. Thanks for joining. Mushy, <laughs> back attack, welcome, welcome. Welcome to the stream. Oh, look at those. Those seem kind of big for flyers. Age indeterminate, gender asymptotic, 2.27 meters. Temperament unpredictable. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. They're so unpredictable. There's a sentinel. Ah, red dot. Oh, off I go. I'm gonna find these animals. E uh where'd you go? Where'd you go, red dot? He's a fish. He's a fish. He's okay. Reltrell's a bell. Reltrell's a bell. He's the predator fish. Reltrell's a bell. He's fast. Look at him go. What's in this crater? Nice crater. What a weird looking place. Where'd he go? Fishy, fishy. Oh, all the way back. He's doing laps. This guy's getting his exercise. What does he look like? Some blob. Just like a blob, really. It's no big deal. Oh, back attack. That's awesome, man. Wow. <laughs> no, that's, you're funny. You're a funny guy. 
Thanks for joining the chat. Just remember, I appreciate all the interactions. It all helps my stats. I'm glad you're here. Thank you. Oh, a different kind of night flyer. Ursephesi Ernekion. Mature female, sedate. How big was it? 0.9 meters. See, those other ones were huge. Steve, I appreciate you. Fidel Nuspiar. Little anglerfish. Those are fun. Whoa. Finding all the fish and the flyers right off the bat. Oh, whoops. I didn't mean to do that. Whoops, whoops, whoops. I gotta fix that. Sorry, Masked Hero. I didn't mean to. Yeah, oh man. Fun with trolls tonight, huh? No Man's Sky really tests my pronunciation skills too. I love trying to pronounce these names. It's ridiculous. Oh, I got the whole bottom section of the list. Almost half of the list already. And it's all the fi it's usually the fish that are the hardest to find, or it has been in the last few places I went, for sure. <laughs> Athuic, welcome to the chat. Haven't seen you in a bit. Nice to see you again. Good to have you here tonight for some No Man's Sky. As we find all the fish and birds just right off the bat. Brilliant. Oh, look at this cave. How can I not go in there? Splash. Yeah, okay. Cool cave. It's really about as good as it gets, though. Yeah, the trolls do come out on Friday, huh? Oh, Masked Hero. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I was avoiding it because I don't feel like doing that right now. Listen, Arnie comes out when Arnie comes out. It just happens. It's got to be right. It's got to be the right moment. It's got to be timely. It's got to be... Fashionable. It's got to be perfect. Oh, and here comes the sun, doo doo doo. -doo. Stabilizing. Yeah, they better be stabilizing. Computer. There's that predator fish. There he is. What about the left moment? Everything's got to be symmetrical, doesn't it? Teleport your cup of tea, but you know the song. <laughs> You're going to put your orange m, m logo back? Do it, I dare you. Scan a plant. Beautiful. Where? 
Let's see, where's my ship? There it is. I landed here at night during a storm and I got all the birds and fish and I think that is just about the best way you could start off an animal hunt on any planet. That takes care of all the hardest to find stuff right there. Except for cave animals. Fully upgraded, uh, if you mean like my inventory slots and things, then yeah. I've had max inventory for some time. Quite some time. Look, a little trade hole right there. Animal hunt. That's right, Law 17. That's where you try to find the whole list. See this list here? The records list? These are all animals. And when you check off that list, depending on how big it is, you get some units. More units for more animals. How many Omegas that we know of? I believe just the two in the multi-tool, right? Just the two Omegas that you can build for your multi-tool. There's an animal. There's the other gender of that animal. Oh, come on. Where'd he go? There he is. Oh, it's freezing. Don't freeze. Don't freeze.